When you take a closer look at the most common road problems, such as potholes, cracking, rutting, and shoving, it's generally not the asphalt itself that is to blame. It's the base. However, most common repair methods merely fill in the holes, seal the cracks, or cover it up with an additional layer of asphalt called an overlay. Over time, this accumulation eventually needs to be milled down to make room for yet another overlay. All the while, the real problem of failing or insufficient base is never addressed. So it's just a matter of time and the holes, cracks, rutting and shoving reappear in a seemingly never-ending cycle. Eventually, the road may need to be rehabilitated, requiring all of the asphalt and underlying material to be removed, hauled away, and new material to be hauled in, both of which are very costly and time-consuming. Full depth reclamation, which has been around since the 60s, is simply the process of pulverizing an asphalt surface, along with all of its holes, cracks, and ruts, into a reusable material that is uniformly blended and incorporated into the insufficient or failing base, adding both volume and structure. If even greater stabilization is required, a variety of additives such as gravel, road base, cement, or other stabilizing materials can easily be incorporated. This homogeneous mixture can now be reshaped and most importantly, recompacted, providing a more stable base. Finally, a new layer of chip seal or asphalt is applied, resulting in a more durable, longer lasting and smoother road for a small fraction of the cost of rehabilitation. Full depth reclamation has been proven to be faster, less expensive and longer lasting. Rehabilitation projects that would normally take a week or more can be done in as little as one day. Cost savings average 70% or more because of the time saved as well as from reusing existing materials in place. Best of all, now that you've solved the base problem, not just covered it up, the results will last years longer. Look at that material. It's perfect. The gradation is perfect. Moisture is perfect. The fines are perfect. The asphalt is all crumbled up. There's little bits and pieces. Look at this half inch. That's asphalt. This material is perfect for making a wonderful base. This will bond together and be extremely hard. Uh, it couldn't be better. And guess what? There's over a mile of it looks just exactly like this. That's terrific. Other than a backhoe, <laughs> this machine here is the next necessary tool on the job. With the zipper, we no longer have to saw cut it out. We just grind what we need for the day. We start grinding it with one machine. As soon as that goes by in a matter of minutes, I have my excavator come in and they start being able to uh, start opening up trench. And actually it improves uh, compaction results on our, on our backfill material that we dig up. We had six inches of asphalt to grind on a specific job. It took us about eight minutes to go 200 feet. Eight minutes. I mean, I'll be honest with you, the guys couldn't even finish their coffee by the time they had to grab a shovel and get going again. It used to take us two and a half to three hours, multiplied by a group of guys, to get to that same point to have all the asphalt removed. Two and a half to three hours compared to eight minutes is significant. Before we had the zipper, it would take us three to five days to get about 500 linear feet. Saw cutting, pulling it out, removing it, hauling it away, having it recycled, because we have to be on the street at a certain time and off the street at a certain time. Whereas now, with the zipper, we can do that same amount of work within probably about five hours. So it's a heck of a time saver, whereas before it would have taken us, again, three to five days. We were able to do a reclamation job that we had proposed to do half of it in one year, half in the second year, and in less than 80 hours of time on this machine, we did a two-year project. We did six and a half miles, 20 foot wide. You know, based on the cost of much larger machines or multiple machines to do the same job, you can't beat it. 
I haven't seen anything that will equal the asphalt zipper. I recommend it 150 percent. Start to finish, we had a strip 22 foot wide, 250 feet. We finished that in approximately 35, 40 minutes. The zipper will do it in a fourth of the time, half the cost what you normally do. It can pay for itself in one season or less. We'll have a lot of gravel roads that we have just perennial potholes. You've got a pothole here, here, and here. Your motor grader comes down and you, and you put more base on it and you fill these up. We're in the Barnett shell. We get a lot of trucks. The trucks come in and they just literally take that base right back out of those potholes. What we had done to an old gravel road with lots of potholes in it that you continually have to redo, we ground that up, compacted it, got it good and everything compacted together where everything holds together. And it's just like you put down a new road. You don't have that, that pothole is not there anymore. You don't have it where you can knock it out. We water that in, we get it good and wet, we compact it back in. We can do up to a mile and a half of gravel roads in one day. We don't have near the problem that we had before, and we have a lot of truck traffic on that road. Our crews did 153,000 square feet of dig outs with the zipper in two weeks and uh, saved the county about $100,000 in uh, asphalt because we came back in and chip sealed over the top of it after blending the permazyme in with it. Typically, uh, the type of dig outs that we were doing would have taken the, our crews somewhere between six to eight weeks to do them without the zipper by digging them out. So it was definitely well worth the, well worth the money to buy one and it convinced everybody in our department that we needed to buy one and so we found a way to buy it.